the Bumblebee Unboxer, and I'm back with more Transformers and other stuff. So, I found this. I found this at my Walmart. It's really dented, but this was the last one. This is the Hot Rod figure, little figure. I did not know this existed, so I believe now I am finished with the series. I don't know. I'm not going to say that for sure yet. And I also got, you go check out my Bumblebee review one of this. I also got Starscream Wing Slice figure, which is this $7, this $5. This is the same way where I got this Bumblebee figure from. So, and then I got this Walmart exclusive that everyone wants. Venomized Ghost Rider, which is only at uh, my Walmart, and this is $9. So I'm going to any mini miny hot rod. I'm gonna do hot rod first. So here's the front of the box, but then to the front of the box. There's the bottom. There's the side. There's the top. There's the other side with the cool CG photo of um hot rod from the from the um last night movie. And then there's the back that shows the Energon feature, which I will show you. And then it's got everything else. This is part of the Energon Igniter series, by the way. So I'm going to take them out. From the looks of it, right now, I, I'm, I'll have to see when I take it out. But right now, it looks like it's the body is the same mold as the Barricade figure. So... Hmm. I think they just did a cheap way to um to do this. They just did a cheap way to do hot rod. So I need my trusty knife to undo this. But but here are the instructions for the figure. I believe it's almost the same as the barricades instructions. And then there's the other side with the picture. So let's get him out of the package with trusty knife. This knife will change into a different knife. And hopefully next video. So. This knife will change into a different knife. Hopefully in next video. Sorry guys, this is taking so long. This plastic is really hard to get off. There we go. Move all this stuff to the side. So I don't like it scratching me while I'm doing other toys. So, that is uh, the front of this toy of Hot Rod. Like I said, basically the same as um, the barricade. So I'm back with the Autobots. On. Now I did bring the barricade figure over. And you can look real quick and compare them to. Literally, all this is is a different head mold and recoloring. Is all this is. They didn't really try hard on that one. But I, I still wanted it. And then there's the Bug Bumblebee next to it. And then here is Optimus Prime next to it. And here is the Camaro Bumblebee next to it. Like I said, the only one that looks like him is the Barricade one, except for the head. So I'm going to take this... And I am going to 
I am going to pause the video and do these because I'm going to do all of these and I'm not going to do those on camera. So I'll see you when they're all in car mode. Okay, so I'm back and this is Hot Rod in this vehicle mode. So there's the top with the Autobot symbol. There's the side. There's the other side. There's the bottom with that with all the pieces to hot, hot rod. There's the front. There, and there's the back. That's really all there is to this figure. And this is the um I forget his name. Um barricade. This is the barricade one. I totally blinked on the name. This is the barricade one. Look at this and then do not tell me that they do not look the same if you take off those lights. Take off those lights. They're the exact same except for the coloring. That's what I don't like about this figure. They didn't change the design. All they changed was the color and the face. That's it. And this thing. So, so, yeah. I wish I would have gotten one that actually looked like a hot rod. Because, like these ones look like the car that they're supposed to be. I, that just makes me mad. But there's there's his vehicle mode next to Barricade. Next to Camaro Bumblebee. Next to Bug Bumblebee, the main Bumblebee of the movie. And then next to Optimus Prime. So that's that. I'm going to put him up to the side back over here. Oh, I'll show that at the end. And here is the Starscream um wing slice. Now there is um now as you see there's Megatron and Grimlock that I need to find. But there's also there's also I forget her name, but there's the another good Autobot girl, and then there's Optimus Prime, and then there's another Decepticon that I need to find. But there's the front. There's the bottom, there's the side, there's the top, there's the other side with the cool picture of the of Starscream from the show, and then there's the back as you saw with the features and the other characters to collect, which from this line I'm only missing these two, but I'm missing more, I'm missing three more, so yeah, so let's get this thing open. Oh my gosh, they got tape all over us. They always put tape on their toys. They always put tape on their toys. That makes me mad. Because there's no point to it. here take the instructions out of course so there are six steps to this figure wow there's no plastic on this one that's awesome oh they took the features out man i like this bumblebee because it had something like loose but they took that out of here well Kind of, I might play. Um, but there's the there's the figure in robot mode. There's the bottom. There's the side. Top. And you saw the other side. There's the back. And they got the Septicon logos. And here is him compared to the Bumblebee one, the the Sting shot Bumblebee. To be exact, go check out that review. It's really whack. Oh, I just won. So I'm gonna show you a look at the instructions, and then I will turn them into robot mode, um, car mode, or plane mode. So there's one through five, and then that there's that picture of so that's green. And there is the sixth step. And the action feature. So I'm going to pause here.
turn this into robot mode and the bumblebee, and I'll see you when he's transformed. So I'm back, and there is him in jet mode. So I'm going to show him off. So there's the top with the Decepticon logo and these blasters. There's the front. Um, there's the bottom with the head of, of, of Starscream, and then there's the back. So, this is how the feature works. Oh. So, as you see, you push, you push the jet up, and then you push it down, and it makes the wing spin. Which is, I think, is pretty cool for what a toy for what it is it's pretty cool it's really cool it's good it's pretty cool so. So, it's pretty cool for for what it is so so yeah so that's that and i'm going to compare it to the sting shot bumblebee and then that's his go check out his review so there's they are side by side. So yeah, that's there's that. So I'm gonna put the this these to the side and I'll put them back at the end. Now the Venom Eyes Ghost Rider. There's the front of the box with the Venom logo. Go check out this movie. It's still in theaters, but it's about to not be. So go see it. This is only at Walmart. If you're lucky, there's the bottom. There's the side with the cool picture of it. There's the other side with the cool lo with what is name. This is three six nine in the series. This is three hundred and sixty nine in the series. There's the top, and then there's the back with all the other ones that you can collect, not the exclusive ones. So there is Venom. Venomized Captain America, Venomized Iron Man, Venomized Hulk, and Carnage. They had Venomized Captain America and Venomized Iron Man and Venomized Hulk at my Walmart, and I will possibly be picking them, picking one of them up. So, may, tell me in the comments which one I should pick up. So let's get this baby open. Let's get this thing open. Slide him out of the packaging. Box aside, that's him in the packaging. Just open that, take him out. He is a bobblehead, but you really don't want to bobble him because he'll run in the paint. But there he is out of the packaging. I think this looks pretty cool. That's the back. I think this looks pretty cool for what it is for a Venom Pop. That's not for the Venom movie. I think I pretty much, I really like this figure. Now when I get the other figures, possibly, I will show him up, I will show him right next to them. Probably in the box or out of the box. Because I do not want to ruin him. I like to keep my pops in a box. Now I bet you're wondering, why why are you reviewing this pop and are, are, why aren't you reviewing all the other pops that you promised? Because I have Stranger Things over Stranger Things of pops and It Pops and Jurassic World Pops. It's because I just got this and I think you would like this since Venom came out. I will get to those probably in the summer or if I need a video idea really quickly. So just so you know that. I don't know when I'll get to them, but I will. So I'm going to put them all side by side. And I'll show you the secret item that I picked up today too. There they all, they all are side by side. Now the, now, the one thing that will probably, the one thing that will probably scare you, more of the nights he came home, Michael Myers. This I bought this today. This is the new Halloween covered um Michael um not Michael Myers. It is Michael Myers, but it's Halloween too. 
Now only that you only get this exclusive cover, and the inside is the same cover as before. But, but I got this today. The new how this is a Halloween movie. But the night is just beginning. You can buy this at Walmart, and if you do, you get if you do, you get a voodoo card that will give you free glow in the dark art and five hoodoo credits. I'm not going to show it because I could get in trouble by the people who made this. But go buy this movie if you're over 18. Or around that. Or if your parents let you buy it. So And then that's the cover it looks like outside of the box. Side back you can read all that pause it and read it and then yeah, that's the inside so just wanted to show you that so yeah like comment subscribe go subscribe to face macker studios because he shot me out on his on his bumblebee um charge um bumblebee super charge i think it was called um review and he's doing the Into the Spider-Verse reviews. Go check out my Prowler Into the Spider-Verse review. And go check out all my other videos. Go subscribe to everyone because they really deserve it. And you know that. And I will see you all next weekend for my next video. Peace and have a happy Halloween. <laughs>